Uzbek is a Turkic language that is the first official and only declared national language of Uzbekistan. The language of Uzbeks, it is spoken by some 32 million native speakers in Uzbekistan and elsewhere in Central Asia. Uzbek belongs to the Eastern Turkic, or Karlik, branch of the Turkic language family. External influences include Persian, Arabic and Russian. One of the most noticeable distinctions of Uzbek from other Turkic languages is the rounding of the vowel to a feature that was influenced by Persian. Name In the language itself, Uzbek is Ozbek Tili or Ozbeka. In Arabic script, Ozbek Tili and Ozbek. History Turkic speakers probably settled the Amu Darya, Syr Darya and Zarifshan river basins since at least 600–700 CE, gradually ousting or assimilating the speakers of Eastern Iranian languages who previously inhabited Sogdia, Bactria and Khwarezm. The first Turkic dynasty in the region was that of the Kara Khanid Khanate in the 9th-12th centuries, who were a confederation of Karluks, Chijils, Yagma, and other tribes. Uzbek can be considered the direct descendant or a later form of Chagatai, the language of great Turkic Central Asian literary development in the realm of Chagatai Khan, Timur, Tamerlane, and the Timurid dynasty, including the early Mughal rulers of India. The language was championed by Ali Shir Navi in the 15th and 16th centuries. Nave was the greatest representative of Chagatai language literature. He significantly contributed to the development of the Chagatai language and its direct descendant Uzbek and is widely considered to be the founder of Uzbek literature. Ultimately based on the Karlik variant of the Turkic languages, Chagatai contained large numbers of Persian and Arabic loanwords. By the 19th century it was rarely used for literary composition, but disappeared only in the early 20th century. The term Uzbek as applied to language has meant different things at different times. Prior to 1921, Uzbek and Sert were considered to be different dialects. Uzbek was a vowel harmonized Kipchak variety spoken by descendants of those who arrived in Transoxiana with Muhammad Shaybani in the 16th century, who lived mainly around Bukhara and Samarkand, although the Turkic spoken in Tashkent was also vowel harmonized. It can be called Old Uzbek and it's considered to be related to that specific group of people. Sert was a Karlik dialect spoken by the older settled Turkic populations of the region in the Fergana Valley and the Kashkadario region, and in some parts of what is now the Samarkand region, it contained a heavier admixture of Persian and Arabic, and did not have vowel harmony. It became the standard Uzbek language and the official dialect of Uzbekistan. In Khanate of Kiva, Sert spoke a highly Oghuz Turkified form of Karlik Turkic. After 1921, the Soviet regime abolished the term Sert as derogatory and decreed that henceforth the entire settled Turkic population of Turkestan would be known as Uzbeks, even though many had no Uzbek tribal heritage. However, the standard written language that was chosen for the new republic in 1924, despite the protests of Uzbek Bolsheviks such as Fazula Kojiyev, was not pre-revolutionary Uzbek, but the Sert language of the Samarkand region. Edward A. Allworth argued that this badly distorted the literary history of the region and was used to give authors such as the 15th-century author Ali Shir Navi an Uzbek identity. All three dialects continue to exist within modern spoken Uzbek. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Writing systems. Uzbek has been written in a variety of scripts throughout history. Pre-1928, the Arabic-based Yanya Imla alphabet by literates, approximately 3 7% of Uzbeks at the time, 1880s Russian missionaries attempted to use Cyrillic for Uzbek. 1928–1940, the Latin-based Yanyalif used officially. 1940–1992, the Cyrillic script used officially. Since 1992, a Yanyalif-based Latin script is official in Uzbekistan. Despite the official status of the Latin script in Uzbekistan, the use of Cyrillic is still widespread, especially in advertisements and signs. In newspapers, scripts may be mixed, with headlines in Latin and articles in Cyrillic. 
The Arabic script is no longer used in Uzbekistan except symbolically in limited texts or for the academic studies of Chagatai Old Uzbek. .In the western Chinese region of Xinjiang, where there is an Uzbek minority, the Arabic is still used. In Afghanistan, the traditional Arabic orthography is still used. <laughs> Grammar Phonology <laughs> 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 Topic. Vowels Standard Uzbek has six vowel phonemes Topic. Consonants Topic. Morphology and syntax As a Turkic language, Uzbek is null subject, agglutinative and has no articles and no noun classes gender or otherwise. The word order is subject-object-verb Words are usually oxytones i.e. the last syllable is stressed, but certain endings and suffixal particles are not stressed. In Uzbek, there are two main categories of words Nominals equivalent to nouns, pronouns, adjectives, some adverbs Verbals equivalent to verbs and some adverbs verbs Uzbek uses the following verbal suffixes the present and future tenses are both expressed with the a and y suffixes. Articles nouns take the ni suffix as an indefinite article. Unsuffix nouns are understood as definite. Pronouns Topic. Word order the word order in the Uzbek language is subject-object-verb which means that, unlike in English, the object comes before the verb and the verb is the last element of the sentence. Topic. Number of speakers Estimates of the number of speakers of Uzbek vary widely. The Swedish Encyclopedia National Encyclopedian estimates the number of native speakers to be 30 million, and the CIA World Factbook estimates 25 million. Other sources estimate the number of speakers of Uzbek to be 21 million in Uzbekistan, 3.4 million in Afghanistan, 900,000 in Tajikistan, 800,000 in Kyrgyzstan, 500,000 in Kazakhstan, 300,000 in Turkmenistan, and 300,000 in Russia. Topic: <laughs> Loan words. The influence of Islam, and by extension, Arabic, is evident in Uzbek loanwords. There is also a residual influence of Russian, from the time when Uzbeks were under the rule of the Russian Empire and the Soviet Union. Most importantly, Uzbek vocabulary, phraseology and pronunciation has been heavily influenced by Persian through its historic roots. Words like men I and kitab book are clearly of Persian origin. Dialects. <inaudible> <inaudible> The Uzbek language has many dialects, varying widely from region to region. However, there is a commonly understood dialect which is used in mass media and in most printed materials. Among the most widespread dialects are the Tashkent dialect, Uzbek dialect, the Fergana dialect, the Khorizm dialect, the Chimkent Turkestan dialect, and the Sirkandaria dialect. Topic see also Chagatai language Southern Uzbek language Topic References Topic Sources Topic External links Converters Uzbek Cyrillic Latin Converter Uzbek Cyrillic Latin Text and Website Converter Uzbek Latin Cyrillic Text and Website Converter Dictionaries Dictionary of the Uzbek Language Volume 1, R. Tashkent, 1981 Dictionary of the Uzbek Language, Volume 2, S. Tashkent, 1981 English Uzbek and Uzbek English Online Dictionary English Uzbek and Uzbek English Online Dictionary Russian Uzbek and Uzbek Russian Online Dictionary Uzbek Turkish Dictionary Pamukale University Ol Olofsson, A Vocabulary of the Dialect of Bukhara 1 Kobenhaven 1905 Grammar and Orthography Introduction to the Uzbek Language, Mark Dickens Principal Orthographic Rules for the Uzbek Language, Translation of Uzbekistan Cabinet of Ministers Resolution No. 339, of August 24, 1995 Uzbek Alphabet, Omniglotlearning, Teaching Materials Ona Tili UZ, a website about Uzbek Uzbek language materials, UZ translations <laughs>